Top of the morning, top of the morning, YouTube. What's good with y'all? So we're going to start switching things up. We're going to start getting some fitness and some daily vlogging. Show y'all how I start my day, especially starting at the gym. Try to motivate y'all, encourage y'all to get to it like I'm getting to it. So uh, we over here at this 24-hour fitness. And uh, we about to go in here and get a little arm workout. So uh, let's do that. Follow along. All right, so we're going to start off with the gauntlet. We're going to start off with the 40s, then the 60s, and then the 70s. Then right here is what I use for my forearms. So I'll probably burn out with those each time. That's my max so far. Let's see how this goes. Like I said, the one rip set. Just quick ten. Hey, to failure. All right, now let's hit these seventies. That was good, sir. always seems stronger than my right. So I do three working sets with the 70s. Maybe I hit the 75s one time. 75 going on. Let's see if I can get it. One good one. Second one was kind of hard. Two times are cool. So let's see these 70s. So I'm gonna knock out another four piece. So I'll do one more set of four. Definitely not easy. Four, do the sixties, then the forties. Pyramid sets. I only hit three on that one. I'm cool with that. Yeah. 
before. All right, we on this one next. I know y'all remember this one. Preacher Curl. Since my arms are already warmed up, I thought it's three plates on it. Wind it up. You could either let it just drop or you could wind it down. You get the positive resistance and the negative resistance when you do. Now go for it, man. It's all good. like that. heavy as I possibly can, do three working sets. That means do the max amount of reps per set. Then I just took the weight off, 25 pounds off, and it burned out until failure. We're gonna try to crack out six more.
and then do it again. Pyramids, that's definitely tire you out faster. All those are warm ones. Drop it, drop it down 10 more pounds. Now we're at 80. Contract at the bottom, squeeze. Pyramid says start at 80, then to 70, 60, 50, 40, 30, 20. Same thing for everyone. Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
last set of those. I'm going to get these forearms. Working forearms. And then also your wrist and grip. It's just burnouts on these. Keep switching arms until failure. So when you grab these dumbbells, you can hold on to them. You don't want them falling out your hands. Looking kind of, looking kind of slow. All right, now we're about to hit some uh, some stomachs. Little cheap little ab wheel. Second set, I did one more set, and that's it for the workout. Hopefully I was able to provide help some tips that you could possibly use. If not, maybe tomorrow. All right, y'all, so I'll call that a wrap. Got a real good uh, arm workout in, did some core. Now I know this may not be a video, that all of y'all might appreciate, but I know some of y'all are on this journey with me and will appreciate the content, the information, motivation, and inspiration. So uh, for those of you that did watch it and that do appreciate this content, make sure you smash that like button so I know it. That way I, keep, I can keep pushing it. Now, we do have some more fish content going on today. So, we're going to see how uh, we're going to see what's going on in the fish room. But, like I said, this is just like a vlog type deal. Letting y'all see what I get down with in the morning at this gym, how I do it. And some of y'all always think that I'm on steroids. <laughs> but no, it's a lot of hard work, a lot of sweat equity. So, uh, if I was on steroids, I would have did it years ago and I'd be a lot bigger. But, uh, yeah, I appreciate y'all. Appreciate all of y'all for uh, watching. Tuning in. Smash that like button. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. And uh, I'm going to catch y'all later. Peace.